shooter. Police are trying to figure out who keeps breaking windows at a Northeast Albuquerque community center. The latest attack was last night, and all that broken glass is costing us taxpayers thousands. KOT Action 7 News reporter Kirsten Swanson explains why they're having trouble finding who's doing it. Manuel Guzman grew up in the neighborhood near the Mesa Verde Community Center. I came to this place as a kid and a lot of good memories here. Years later, Guzman is back. He's with the company that's fixing this again. Crews have been to this community center a couple times already boarding up windows that have broken and today they're back. More broken glass to be fixed. The crews say they should be here for about three or four hours. The city says it shelled out almost $10,000 in the last month just to repair the glass and cover graffiti on the building. Leaders at Mesa Verde say they have an idea of who's doing it, a group of middle school aged kids, but no one at the center can get eyes on the group. They're operating at night and we're not having any uh, witnesses to, to see them do that. Mesa Verde is trying to light up the area to keep the vandals away at night. As Guzman measures for the new windows, he tells us kids in the neighborhood need the center. This is one of the places they can come to and, and be safe and, and keep busy and stay out of trouble. Just like the trouble, Guzman is cleaning up again. Kirsten Swanson, KOAT Action 7 News. If you have any information or see anything unusual around Mesa Verde Park, call Crime Stoppers. A student from